So hey what's up guys, how's Shane back with another video and so in this video I'm gonna show you the latest Snapchat hack which has been released by some developers out there and through which you will be able to use plenty of things with your Snapchat app which you was not able to use by the normal Snapchat app. So let's get started. So you so for this hack you don't need to be on your jailbroken device but as you can see my device has been jailbroken as you can see this power icon right over here but for whatever reason the snapchat tweak phantom has stopped working on the jailbroken version as well so in this video i'm i'm going to show you how you can use that same version in non jailbroken device so let's get started for this you need to head over to your safari web browser and search for the following url i have the links down in the description as well you need to search for this tutuapp.vip now you need to click on this regular version because the vip version is the paid one and now you need to click on download now so now it will ask you to install the app i have already installed it so that's why i i'll click on cancel so as you can see this app will be installed on your mobile device to do app so before opening this app you need to go to your setting and click on verify profile you just you just need to go to your setting and then click on general and after that you just need to click on um, device management and click on this profile this is the winner winner media code dot limited and you do, you need to click on verify so then the your app will be verified and you need to go to this to do app and open it all right so after opening this app you need to search for snapchat plus plus wait so this is not a ad free version because it was free so you need to click on snapchat plus plus and you need to install the first app which you are getting so as you can see this is the app you need to click on install and now it will download it so i'll not download it again because i already have it or let's just download it um, it will take a couple of minutes depending on the internet speed And so after downloading the file you will get a pop up with saying tutu app will like to install the snapchat plus plus you just need to click on install i already have this app as well so i'll click on cancel and now you need to go to your home screen so after downloading it your app will be right over here on your home screen so before opening it you need to go again to your settings and click verify this profile this beijing wise non technology app so after verifying this as well you need to open the snapchat plus plus so i don't know that it is a ad free version or not boom there you go so as you can see here we have the snapchat plus plus now you need to click on login and you need to log in with your id and password and so like as you can see i have logged in into my snapchat plus plus account and now you can use every possible thing out of the snapchat plus plus so now let's just try creating some customized filters you just need to click on right over here and you need to click on add so now i'll just choose some image and now i'll just select um, let's say i'll just select this image so now i'll just click i'll just give it a random name i'll just click on save and i'm good to go so now when i click on some photo and now i will swipe swipe it and so where is it boom there you go so as you can see because the image was very large and that's why it's coming in full screen but you can do with it various sizes so now let me just show you some other features of this app as well so when you'll click here then you will be able to transfer your image files directly to the snapchat app without those border lines which say 4 hours ago or 3 hours ago so wait let me just try importing some snaps i'll just go into this thing and let me just upload this file so i'll just click on done i'll just go it here and upload it to my story and now so as you can see i've uploaded this file to my story without those border lines which said 2 hours ago or 3 hours ago let me just quickly delete it and now let me just show you some other things which you can do with this as well so you can go into the settings option and check various things you can do with this thing wait let me just go to the snap plus plus settings um boom there you, there it is so as you can see here we have plenty of options to choose from privacy setting display type and notification screenshot receipts and there are many things which you can do here uh, just go to snap unlimited snap views high snap timer so there are plenty of things which you can do with this thing so wait let me just go to here and there are options to hide this discover tab as well so let me just show you how you can save someone else's snap without the other person even knowing and all right guys now i'll just click on this story and as you can see here we have options for um to mark it as seen or to save it so i'll just click right over here oh wait i'll just click right over here and so a pop up will come up and it will ask you to select where to save this files you can save it to your camera roll album snapchat documents and share media so i'll just click it on camera roll and boom as you can see it's saving now and as you can see success so it the file has been imported to my camera roll without the other person even knowing it 
and as you can see here I have this file so I can view it as many times as I can and so by default Snapchat only allows you to view two times the snap which you have received but by this option you can do it with unlimited times so I don't have any received snaps right now so that's why I can show you but that function also works so, and so guys there is one more feature which you can do with this is that you can spoof your location or oh, I'm sorry not your location but your temperature the moving speed and the time and the date wait let me just show you so for this you need to go to your snap plus plus settings you need to click on visibility and spoofing settings so let's just say I'll just click on set kilometers per hour and I'll just click it on 670 and I'll click on this spoof kilometers per hour and let me just spoof the temperature as well I'll just click on spoof Fahrenheit and now the temperature will be 150 degree Fahrenheit wait let me just show you I'll just click on done and back and now I'll just snap some photo and wait boom so oh I'm sorry it's miles per hour um, I'll just single click on it and as you can see it's 670 kilometers per hour and but as you can see I am still there is no chance that I'm on a 670 kilometers per hour speed and as you can see um, wait let me just show you temperature in Fahrenheit as you can see 150 degree Fahrenheit so this thing is pretty cool as well so now let me just show you the most coolest feature of this app that is the location spoofing with this thing you can tell your friends that you are in any part of the world without even going there so obviously I'm not in Brazil right now I'll just click on Brazil and click on confirm and now I'll just snap some photo and now I'll just swipe and Alright guys, so for whatever reason this thing is not working on my mobile right now but it used to work before but probably this is a beta version so that's why there are some error in it. Let me know in the comments down below if this thing is working on your device but it's not working on my device as of now. So that was pretty much it for this video. If you guys wait till the end, drop a like to this video and if you want making more such kind of videos, hit the bell subscribe button and I'll see you in the next one.